Ooh, what's going on, everyone? We're going to be playing some Gaming Watch Gallery 2 today. I think I'm going to play Chef. We're going to do it on hard mode. As you can see, I've, I've played a round or two. I've gotten to 772 points, but we're not satisfied yet. We have to unlock very hard mode, of course. And what's a better way to do that than by getting a hundred, or not a hundred, getting a thousand points in everyone's favorite difficulty, flower mode. So this is Chef. It's pretty simple. I mean, it is a Game & Watch game after all. You play as the princess. The bros are chucking food at you. You have to not make a mess on the floor. Pretty basic stuff. Uh, you have a Yoshi. Yoshi is the eater, of course. He is, in fact, the guy that loves to eat. Speaking of which, uh, are, ki are the kids still talking about that? Or am I... Not, not the kids. Are people still talking about that? Because... I don't know. I don't really think it was a kid's thing, and also, the fact that I said the kids is at least a little obnoxious. I don't want to sound, like, really, like, pretentious. And Yoshi ate so much he gave birth? Or maybe, uh, maybe a she? Because, it, you know, the Yoshi gives birth. I don't think Yoshi functions like a seahorse. Granted, also, I think the, the sex of a fictional dinosaur doesn't matter too much. And Yoshi's usually a guy in pretty much everything. At least I think. Yeah, you know what? Call me crazy. Yoshi is a guy, and those aren't really eggs. That That's my theory. I think they're just like projectiles that look like eggs. That's why he gets them after eating. Oh, shoot. We almost had the Yoshi go hungry. Whoa, 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 whoa. All right. We're so fine. Yoshi is eating up a storm. We're already at one star. But, uh, yeah. Just like the Burger Time video, I'm not gonna say it. I refuse to say it. The minute I say it is the minute you can take me out behind the barn and... Do the thing that you do behind barns. Whoa, 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 whoa. Alright. We're fine. Okay. Come on, Yoshi. Just eat these, uh... Perfectly cooked sausages. Perfectly cooked eggs. Perfectly cooked fish. I believe if Yoshi eats enough raw or burnt food, he eventually... Gets younger. So... You know, if you're searching for the Fountain of Youth, then you found it, my boys. Just eat a bunch of raw food. They're probably not raw pork chops. That doesn't sound like something you should do. Okay, we're fine, though. We can double up over here, then we'll go like that. We're fine. Okay, Yoshi? Oh, they grow up so fast, don't they? Uh, you know, my question for the comments is, uh... This is a food-related video. Uh, you guys have probably seen that PETA billboard that, like, tries to... Tries to get you, but, you know, it doesn't really do it. Uh, it says, has your child got aught? No, no, I'm just kidding. Uh, it's the one where it's a bunch of, like, different animals, and then it says, where do you draw the line? Because it's like, oh, why are, why are we okay with eating some animals but not others? 
So my question to you is, where do you guys draw the line? I've been, I've been thinking about this question. And if we're not factoring in conservation status, because... Simply put, I don't know the conservation status of every animal. Thank you, Yoshi. Uh, if we're not factoring in conservation status, I think I'm gonna have to draw the line at lemurs. Because, like, if you really think about it... Like, humans are obviously off the table. Because of, like, prions and all that nonsense. And then... I don't know if you could get prions from monkeys, but... They're a little too human-like, for my liking. Same goes for, uh, gray apes. I still don't completely trust that. So yeah, no humans, no great apes, because of, uh, prions. And then, I think, like, you know... No humans, no great apes, no monkeys. So we have all the simians down. But I think once you start getting, like, pro-simian and lower... Yeah, that, that's completely fine to be on the table. Not factoring in conservation status. I, I will rephrase that, because... Obviously, you don't want to... Eat something with, uh, low conservation status. It's just simple... Simple supply and demand. It'll probably get expensive really fast. Also, it'll be easier to run out. Alright, we're fine now. We're almost at 700 points, so we almost get our life back. Because this is the, the pretty basic... Yoshi, are you kidding me? Alright. Just, just lay your eggs a little faster. I don't know how Yoshi biology works, but... Can you at least try, Mr. Yoshi? Alright. We're almost there, we're almost at 700. I really don't want to mess up. Messing up would make me feel very sad. So let's not do that. Okay. You finally lay your stupid egg. Alright. We get our life back, but then we lose it immediately after. Oh well. We're fine. Because it's just Egg City. I almost think it's not worth it to feed Yoshi anymore. Like, just on the off chance that he gets slightly delayed. And I forget that he'll get slightly delayed. So I think I'm just gonna keep destroying all of this food. Very wasteful, I know. There are some kids in uh, Sarasa land that could have uh, eaten it. But oh well. Or, you know what, Yo Yoshi's too cute. I can't neglect him. But I will feed him a little more raw food. Okay. We're fine. Just eat all this crap. Or, sorry, not crap. It's food. Okay. That almost gave me a heart attack. Hi, uh, figuratively. It almost gave me a figurative heart attack. Not a literal heart attack. But, uh, yeah. That was a little too tense for my liking. Too tense in the wilderness. It's like Brokeback Mountain out here. Hoo-hoo-hoo. Alright, we're at four stars. We have to... We gotta do it, man. We are this close. We can't crap out at the last second. Just eat all that nonsense. We slow down. Perfect. Sometimes you just gotta take it slowly. You know how it is. 
take the scenic route in life. I like that we could just keep flipping. All right. 916. You know, we didn't get to uh, 1,000 points on Donkey Kong first try, so I'm pretty satisfied. Hopefully next time we play Chef, we will make it to the coveted 1,000 points. And I'll see you guys next time.